Hi, my friends. Recently, my husband and I collected honey from our hive, and I wanted to share with you the experience of our honey harvesting. The intention of this video isn't necessarily to be a how-to instructional video, but rather a brief and fun overview of the passage from point A to point B from hive to jar. So come along with me and I'll show you how we collected our pure golden honey from our beehive. To start our honey harvest journey off, my husband is removing the hive portion called a honey super. The honey super is a box that sits on top of the portion of a hive that is used for collecting honey. Inside the box are frames holding honeycomb with the honey sealed inside the honeycomb. A frame originally begins with just wax in the classic honeycomb shape. Then the bees fill the cells with honey and put a wax cap on top to seal the honey inside the honeycomb. It's their way of saving the honey for long-term storage. You'll see what I'm talking about shortly. This is the rest of the hive where most of the bees are and also the queen. Just a little smoke is added before fully opening this section to collect more frames. The smoke has a calming effect on the bees, but have no worries, it does not harm them. Within a few moments, they return to their normal animation. You can see more frames here inside the main hive. You may notice the wax of this honeycomb is dark instead of pale, and that's because it's an older capped honeycomb. My husband will first give the frame a shake to get the majority of the bees off. But don't worry, this doesn't hurt the bees. Then a light brushing to get the remaining bees off. We're done with the frame removal, so now we'll move the boxes with the frames to a different location for the honey extraction. Here's the older honeycomb. And here's a frame of the honey from the super, which contains younger, light-colored honeycomb. A special roller is used to puncture the wax capping atop the honeycomb. This opens up the cells and allows the honey to be extracted. Then the frame is placed into the extractor, which uses centripetal force to whip the honey out. Let me slow this footage down so you can see the honey being whipped out. You can see the golden honey collecting at the bottom. The honey passes through a mesh filter as it flows into the food grade plastic bucket to strain out the large chunky wax bits. But other than that, that's all the processing that happens before we pour it into jars. There were some yellow jackets around who were definitely interested. Some of the frames we reserve for cutting honeycomb instead of extracting. If you've never sucked on honeycomb with the honey still in it, it's quite the treat. We'll save a couple for ourselves, but spoiler alert to friends and family, Christmas gifts! I'm so glad that you joined me for this honey journey from hive to jar. We have been pretty excited about collecting our honey and are looking forward to many more years of honey harvesting and sharing the pure liquid gold, as I call it, with friends and family. Now, a couple of years ago, I did a video on bee propolis. So if you want to learn more about that amazing bee product that has natural antibiotic properties and other health nutrient properties as well, click right here. I also have some other videos that you may be interested in right here. And be sure to hit that subscribe button and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.